Good afternoon. My name is Clarence. Um, music in the background, because somebody's going to ask me. It's Keith Frank, LA26. And the name of the song is called Come On Home. Um, the video this afternoon is about um, some unexpected noise that I'm hearing in my vehicle. And it actually sounds like a it sounds like a plane flying right on the side of my vehicle. And what come to find out, it was my door molding, upper molding seal. And I'm gonna show you exactly what, it, what I'm talking about. Let's step up a little bit, a little closer. Um, this seal right here, this piece right here is the back seal. This piece right here is the front seal. Now, what happened, um, they got little plastic clips on them, and what the clips has been doing is um, breaking off. Once the clip breaks off, and you get up to 55, 65, 70 miles an hour, this thing catch wind. And when it catch wind, it make a hell of a noise. Um, right now, this one is broke. I know it's broke, because I looked in my rear view mirror when I was traveling on the interstate, and I saw this piece right here flaps up. And all you heard was a hell of a noise. Um, what I'm gonna show you today is how to repair that. Or you can go to the dealer, buy a new one, they're about $94, buy your new one and replace it. Um, but tonight, I'm gonna do a, um, a, a clearance fix. <clears throat> and it should last you as long as you're on the vehicle. Uh, and what I did was I bought, I got a two-sided tape that I'm gonna use Step over here and uh, open the door. Let me try to get that in there for you as best I can. And so now I got the door open right here, right? So let me move this back a little bit. And the piece is right here, this piece right here. So I already know it's broke. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slide this piece off, okay. Hang in with me. I'm gonna show you exactly what I'm doing. Hang in with me. This is broke. I already know this is broke. Um, it's a slide off piece. Uh, let's see here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slide, go ahead and slide it off. Not just this vehicle, it's, all, it's on most new vehicles anyway. So all I'm gonna do is, is slide this, this piece off so I can get it off here. If you're not sure about it, don't do it. Because I don't want you trying to sue me. Alright, now I got it off. It's a piece of door molding. And right here is a clip. I don't know if you can see it. That's a clip. And here's a clip up here. And now here's a clip. All three clips are supposed to be attached to this plastic molding. It that broke off. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix it. So that we can keep um so we can keep the same piece of molding and you don't have to worry about replacing the molding. Now my fix to it was I went to the auto parts store, right? And I bought some tape. I bought some double-sided tape. Auto part double-sided tape. I already got a piece that's pre-cut. God. Um I already got a piece that's pre-cut, right? And now close the door a second. And so what we're gonna do since the molding, the lead air catches the air, right? This edge right here, it catches all the air. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my double-sided tape. It's got padding here. It's got padding right here on the double on the edge, the lead edge. So I'm gonna take my double-sided tape and I'm gonna put it right on that padding. And I'm gonna seal it like this. Now, this is double-sided tape. Now, you may want to run your tape all the way around the edges. I'm just going to, for now, in this video, I'm just going to hit this piece right here. Okay? And then I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to peel, I'm going to peel this double-sided tape liner off. See? Then I'm going to go back and make sure this is tacky ends on. Now the clips on your door, you got a choice. If you want to take these clips off, 
You can take the clips off or you can leave them on. But for me right now, I'm just gonna leave the clips on. And this is a lot cheaper than trying to take it to the shop paying three or four hundred dollars for them to fix. So now I'll open the door back up. At the bottom of it is a lip. That lip has to fit inside of this seal. So I'm gonna fit that lip inside of that seal. And then I'm gonna fit the top part in that in the, in the groove up there. And then you come to the back of it and you hit it. And you knock it all the way back on, okay? And what is gonna happen? It's gonna seal. Wait a minute, and I missed it. Hold your horses. All of my problems I'm working on. Huh? Knock it right back on. So it went on, and uh, let me bring the camera around here. It's a lip right here, so that lip catches the back end of it. And it's seated in the bottom. And then the top front end here, what was catching air, shouldn't catch air anymore. Because what I did was I got it, um, I got it taped, I got it double sided taped down. And it should be good. Also, there's a rubber seal right here. Make sure that rubber seal is up against it. So that will keep this from catching any air at all. And if you look at it, it's actually on there pretty good. It's on there pretty good. So it shouldn't go anywhere. It's got the double-sided automotive tape on it. Um, and that should be about it. Now, and it's, it's back in place. And I got the fingerprints off of it. And I don't have to worry about it. Um, other than that, that's about it. That's how you fix the top door molding that's hanging off your vehicle and if it catches enough wind you'll know it's hanging because it's going to be making a hell of a racket other than that um if you have any questions hit me up on my youtube page go down hit the like button like the video if you like it um thumbs down if you don't like it send me your input and i'll make the adjustments also go ahead and subscribe so that you can see what's coming up. You get a chance to see what's coming up. Also, you can take, go ahead and take a look at the other videos I got in there. Other than that, I'm Clarence. Peace.